In this video a circuit with which you can switch a radio coil, for instance from an oscillator, a VFO, could be a local oscillator in a radio, shortwave radio, between two frequencies. And here I combined two very simple circuits. At first the non-stable multivibrator and here the oscillator. And I've used here kind of trick. I've used here a transistor as a switch. This transistor is driven by the multivibrator that every six seconds uh, switches on and off. And that means that this transistor acts as a switch that switches on the 1200 picofarad into the tank circuit. An extra capacitor. Here is a shortwave radio coil, that's here, bridged here with a 1200 picofarad cap. And the transistor switches an extra cap from 1200 picofarad every 6 seconds. So this is what happens in that case. Now the transistor is switched switches back, etc. And you can set the time during which the uh, its frequency is hold by the cap, these caps, this one and this one, and by the two potentiometers here from the multivibrator. So very simple combination from two circuits. Here is the oscillator, that's here on the breadboard. Uh, you set the oscillation here with the pot meter. And well, there's not so much more to tell. Of course, when you use another coil, another cap, and another cap here, you can get to other frequencies, but the maximum frequency is limited here by the BC507B that can um, amplify high frequencies up to approximately 9 MHz. Here we see how the counter reacts. And it's a proof of principle circuit. Of course it must be adapted to your own needs when you want to use it.